Welcome to JavaScript Performance. Is this an oxymoron? Maybe, maybe it's not. We'll find out. So anyways, fast is kind of relative. So that term doesn't mean anything. So if you're going to make JavaScript fast, you can always have fast JavaScript. Now, will JavaScript ever be as fast as Go or Rust? Probably not in our lifetime or anyone's lifetime because it's just not the kind of language to go that kind of speed. But can it be fast comparatively? Absolutely. You've seen all the benchmarkings in the world where one framework is five times faster than another framework, and you see it all the time. So fast does have meaning, and we are going to try to relatively make our JavaScript significantly faster, okay? And we're going to have a lot of fun techniques and all that. All right, so what is this uh, course about? Well, it's as much about JavaScript fundamentals as it is about performance. If you stick through the whole course, you're going to learn a lot about how JavaScript hopefully works underneath the hoods. Uh, these skills will be partially transferable or mostly transferable to any GC-based language because similar concepts exist kind of everywhere. 